What is up, my Squirtleites? It is I, your king. Welcome you back to more Let's Play Fallout 4. Don't really need to do any introductions, do I? We can just jump right on into this because we're back to exploring in this episode as we have been for the last few episodes and as we will continue to do for the next few episodes. So, uh, ignore the marker on my radar for right now. We're going to be heading back over that way once we have finished this entire side of the map. I have all of this area to clear out right now. This is what I'm primarily focused on in this episode. And we're basically just going to walk until we see hollow... Um, area markers basically undiscovered locations what the heck oh, oh hold on hold on dog meat ah, bah, 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 bah. wait actually i can hit your blood sack i'd rather do that first perfect get out of here all right we're good um i'm gonna try to okay so i know i have like incredibly good dog meat you hear that is that not something we need to be concerned about okay um I have incredibly good perks um, on this character that allow me to basically just use VATS, almost like a cheat code, and I have decided that from here on out, I am going to make an attempt. I don't know if I'll be able to do it because of muscle memory, but I am going to at least make an attempt to tone down my VATS usage in uh, further on, in the, or as I go continue in this game, just because, yeah, like I said, it's like a cheat code. I can just immediately hit everything with perfect accuracy in this game and i get that fallout is and i can rpg and if i was playing like well let's say any of the other fallouts and i had that it would be a godsend but okay hold on let's not let's not freeze here okay so we got some raiders in here and we're gonna give this a shot right off the bat here with let's let's go with pin missiles since we're going up against people no, I'm not disappearing. Are you kidding me? I'm right here. You just can't see me because you're stupid. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, if it's if this was any other Fallout, I get it. It would be all I'd be using anyway. But in this game, like, I don't know. I have a slightly better... Oh, <laughs> I have to reload. Um, I, I have a slightly better... Um, slightly better... Uh, gunplay system at my disposal and I should probably actually use that. Hello? Are you stuck in there? I see you. Eh. Oh, that probably didn't feel too good. Here, you want to reload? Why does it not auto-reload this thing? This is probably why I stopped using this harpoon gun is just because it fails to auto-reload sometimes and it's like that's the thing that I need you to do because you are a one-shot weapon. Get out of here. Okay, did I pin you to the wall? No, I didn't. That would have been hilarious though. Okay, yeah, we're not using vats. Let's just shoot that guy. Okay, I think the rest are upstairs. Is there a, did I hear a puppo? Did I hear a puppo? I did, I did not hear a puppo. All right, let's keep... It might have been my puppo, but whatever. I thought there was a, an additional puppo. Hello? What's up? Oh, legendary raider, huh? Hold on. Eh, okay. We're at, no, 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 no. We are, we are in close quarters. Hold on a second. Let me switch uh, guns here. Let's try Kellogg's pistol for a second here. Hey, what's up? Yeah. Oh, that isn't actually doing as much damage as I would like, and this is why we use... Ow, 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 ow. Don't prick it. Gosh dang it. Okay, what do I... What can I use that would be better at... Oh, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I don't really have anything that's good at... Fine. We'll use the Uzinator, I guess. Holy grenades. Relax. Get out of here. What are you exploding? Stop that. What the frick? Okay, who is tossing grenades like they're... Oh, a, a missile launcher? Okay. Yeah, who is tossing grenades like this? You need to stop. Also, guns, please. Auto-reload. No. Get out of here. Jeez. Holy crap. You had another one, too. You were going to throw, like, your entire arsenal. Not just your entire arsenal. Well, I mean, I guess it makes sense, considering I was wiping you all out. But I was going to say, you're going to throwing your entire uh, group's arsenal of grenades at me. Let's get rid of that. Relentless machine launch. Mer machine. Missile launcher. I don't think I actually want that. Um, I would like to get a, a missile launcher at some point, just because it would be fun to add to our um, our build that we're gonna take to uh, Nuka World when we get around to it. Um, I have some I have some plans uh, for when when we do eventually get around to going to Nuka World. Some plans on what sorts of weapons I'm gonna be using. It's gonna be fun. Okay, no, that's useless to me because I have already destroyed uh, destroyed the turret. D -d -dog, dog, dog meat, buddy. Can you move? Thank you. Okay, we don't actually need to go in here because I've already explored this place. I just wanted to take a look at the things that will, or the item containers that auto respawn, and we can move on from there. Okay, so I see something that's undiscovered over to the west here, so we're going to head towards that. Um, 
Where are we about on the map at the moment? Right here. Okay, yeah, that, make, that makes sense. That makes sense. We can head over west this way and then move on south from there. I do believe this is the gunner's headquarters um, right over the ridge here. I think. Nope, that is not it. It's actually probably a different location. But I felt like they were in... No, nope, no, okay, never mind. I feel like they're somewhat nearby. Isn't it this part of the map that they're in? Hello? More shooting. And I'm hearing voices. Alright, well, let's head on over to this thing. Oh, okay, I know exactly where we are. Um, I am going to switch over to Overseer's Guardian. For this. Okay, I do... I am a little bit curious about that. Oh, hello there, sir. Jeez, you guys are making all sorts of fun explosions. That was probably a suicide... Nope, those are cars. Those are definitely cars that are just going off one by one. Awesome. Okay, I need to take care of these... We're going to be fighting a lot of super mutants here, so get ready. Um, there's a ton in this area. Hello there, is that one? I can't actually tell. There's a... Oh, there's a baby mutant hound. Okay, that thing's dead. It wasn't legendary, though. So let's go grab its thing. Where were you guys fighting? You guys were... Oh, you were fighting a sentry bot. Okay, well, I'm glad you dealt with that because I definitely didn't want to deal with that. Although that means that because you won the fight, you are even more deadly and strong, and that's bad. Ah, get... Stop it. Stop it. Dog meat. Hold him. Get... Da, 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 da. I'm missing my shots. Missing my shots. Oh, this is not working out. This is not working out at all. Ow, 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 ow. Sir, stop. I really wish that you would just... Uh, what the frick? Oh, my gosh. The hitbox got smaller because dog meat had him. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, this is not working at all. There are more that are alerted to my presence now because this dummy decided to... What the frick? Why am I shots not landing? I am, like, dead on... Eh, eh. Come on. Come on. Just die. Oh my gosh, how much health do you have, sir? And this is why we vats. Okay, maybe I should at least for the crits, because my oh that was just that was just unbelievable. Okay, so now for this place. I believe this place is also infested by Superman. So let's get up on this tree and have a Well, I was gonna use that as a vantage point, but I guess not. Uh, what do we got? Alright, hello there. Probably don't. Okay, these are all warlords. Well, this is okay. This is why we use vats because this is just stupid. This is apps. This is the part of the game where it just gets kind of stupid, and I have to do a ridiculous amount of damage because they have the highest level enemies, and I just gotta shoot crits like crazy. Okay, that probably killed him, right? Nope, not quite. Die. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Okay, Overlord isn't as bad. There we go. All right, now we're back in caution. Um, let's see here. I could use torn AC. Well, it's not as useful on these guys, honestly. I, it's better on like robots and feral ghouls and things like that. Hello? I don't see anybody. All right, well, I'm gonna. Oh, there's one. That is not hitting him. Eh, come on, there we go. Got rid of him. Okay, yeah, they definitely know we're here now. What's up, skirmisher? Oh, gosh. Get out. Get away from me. I'm getting shot from the side. Hold on. Okay, where are you at? Who's shooting me from the side? Something was clearly shooting me from the side. Oh, God. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, hi up there. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on a second. I'm very afraid that they we're going to run into a suicider here. Um, that's kind of why I want to... Dog meat, where are you? Where? Where are you in there? Oh, gosh. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hold on. Just stay right there. You're going to be fine. No, no. Uh, hey. Stop that, dog. Get out of here. All right. Let's see. What do we got? We got that. We had that guy up there. There's one apparently right above us. Oh, I see you. I see you. Hold on a second. Dog meat. You're going to be fine. Uh, let's switch to Overseer's Guardian again. Oh, gosh. Oh, that's not. Oh, my God. Another warlord. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, if I can just kick, pop you in the head a couple of times, that would be great. Nope, not working, not working, not working. Okay, well, the good news is, is the spread on that weapon is so ridiculous that I don't have to worry about him hitting me with it too much. Let's get another crit. And then once we have done that, let's move up, move up, move up. Go, 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 go. Okay, I am low on AP. That's fine. That's fine. All right, let's see. Um, 
I'm gonna go back to Minesweeper. I'm just very worried about suiciders. So I'm gonna work my way up here. Here we go. Hello, sir. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh, I thought that they both had miniguns here. Have that. Just a second. Okay, I probably didn't feel too good. You dead yet? Nope. You can die. Oh, this is gonna do a lot of damage. Hold on. Entire clip, here we go. Ah, just die, both of you. Oh my gosh, please die, please die, please die. Thank you. Holy crap. Holy crap, that was ridiculous. All right, move, move, move. I'm gonna go in here, there is a steamer trunk. Awesome. Ooh, we got Tales of a uh, Junkdown Jerky Vendor. I will absolutely take that as well. But there are still so many more enemies left to deal with. I don't want the armed guards. I want... Okay, I'll take the mini nuke. Let's see. Um, it looks like we got a few directly below us. There you go. More warlords, which is just awesome. All right, that's going to hurt. That's a good throw. That was a really good throw. All right. Well, have that. T two can play at that game. Who's right here dog meat oh gosh oh my gosh seriously freaking everything here is a warlord and an overlord this is ridiculous oh my gosh and no i can't use the usinator because these guys these guys are super resistant to it all right here you come here no we are gonna hit you in the head a few times point blank range because it's the only way we can freaking deal with you and because kellogg's pistol does excel with vats that's a good way to deal with you. All right. Let's see. I don't need your fusion cells. Oop. Don't shoot the mannequin. He's done nothing. There we go. Ugh. Hold on. Get another shot in there. There's another shot. Okay. Back up. Back up. Back up. Okay. We got six shots. Let's make them count. Uh, you, sir. Another crit. Boom. Okay. Wait. Hold on. No. That was the left arm. I did not mean to shoot at that. Let's let our AP come back. Ah. Frick. Land your shot. Dog okay, I swear. The, the, I love it when dog meat holds them because it does res uh, cause a bit of respite. But gosh, does it make them harder to hit while he does that. Like, I feel like their hitboxes like, get actually smaller than they are. Oh my gosh, are you dead yet? Seriously. Right, hold on. There we go. Move in closer. No. Just die. Fine. You know, maybe using vats is a better idea because this is just getting absurd. Wait there. I mean, no, I didn't. I did not hey, want to tell you to do that. Come on. I wanted the fusion cell. Jeez. Dog meat, stop standing right on top of the things that I'm trying to inspect, sir. Oh, d dog meat, stop! Stop it! Stop! Get away. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Let me look in these. Thank you. Hold on. I want the ammo. <laughs> eh. Give me the ammo. Oh my oh my gosh. Game, you are being so finicky right now. Thank you. Jeez, that was ridiculous. All right, now. Freaking house. Oh, okay, suicider, you. Where is my there it is. Suicider. Thank you. Golly. Well, you were the last one. I hope you were the last one, because that was so annoying. Hello? Anybody here? There's a John, term, John Miller's term, Who is John Miller? Uh, journal entries. Okay, I set up all the cracks I could find in the trailer and made sure all the pipes are clamped tight. I still need to make sure ventilation is set up correctly, but I'll save that for next week. Shelly thinks we should start telling the kids about the shelter so they know where to go in case something happens. I'm not sure what they need to know quite yet, though. Okay, the ventilation is set up, but I'm having issues with the generator. It keeps shutting off for no obvious reason. Whenever the generator shuts off, the ventilation fans no longer work, which apparently vacuum seals the trapdoor on the shelter shut. Let's hope that doesn't happen again. I think I figured out the generator ventilation issues. All the supplies are stocked and ready. The only thing left to do is wait and hope we don't need to use it. I was telling Shane and Kimmy about the shelter, but how do you explain the bomb shelter to a 5- and 7-year-old? I just need to need them to know where it's at, so I tried to get them to repeat a ride, hoping that... Um, would help it sink in. In the tipped over train behind dad's shop, climb up above and drop in the top. They seem to like the rhyme. All right, well, let's go looking for that shelter after we open up this master level safe. All right, right about there. Okay, almost new. Nope. How about there? Ooh, super close. There. Got it. All right. And we got a few things worth getting, but not a whole lot. Okay, so the shop. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my. That's. Oh, so that's where the rest of you are. I, I thought I there were a, more than just the suicider left. All right, well, hold on. Maybe is this the shop that it's referring to? Hello. Die! Oh, of course, the warlord has a melee weapon. You've got to be kidding me. All right, sir. Hi. What the frick? Where are you going? Sir, where are you going? No. Where are you going? Okay, that actually does a lot of freaking damage. I'm going to be using this thing from now on. It's not as much of a waste of ammo, honestly. Okay, let's do that. Let's see if we get some more crit. And then... Eh. Okay, dog meat's got him. Why do you not always auto-reload? And then we crit shot you and hopefully kill you. Nope, not quite. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, and... Barrel stuffed! Alright. Now on to the other guy. Hello? There you are. You. Take that. Okay, that is some good damage right there. That's why I had this weapon. Because it does a lot. Like, holy crap, does it do a lot. Dog meat, please, buddy. Please. Out of the way. Okay. They said tepped over train, and then they said shop. I need to figure this out, and I'm sure the vantage point, point is from upstairs. Let's see. Tipped over train. Here, let's 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 take a look up top. Here, they said drop in the top. What does that mean exactly? Wait, is there? A, oh, is there an elevator here? Hello. Hold on. Let's grab all this. You got some drugs that you can take which are good to have because they sell then we've also got a bottle cap mine and some in a stem pack and a rat away and jet Ooh, all sorts of good thing oh and there's more too there is more okay Dro what they say about dropping the top should I, should I hit the button I should probably hit the button all right button time There it is, right? Oh, no, that just opens up there. No, that just moves those. Okay, so, never mind. Uh, train... I mean, because there's a lot of train cars here. Well, I guess these aren't train cars. These are storage things that would go on a train. I'm so confused. Like, so confused. I hope they aren't just talking about the double... They said a whole shelter... Okay, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Let's go back up again. And let's take a look at the little riddle once more. It's 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 not that I don't get the riddle. I, I mean, I need to remind myself of what it said. But it's... It, no, not that one. Um, let's see here. Gosh dang it. Um, in the tipped over train behind Dad's shop, climb up above and drop in the top. Okay, yes. So... Where is the tipped over train? That's the part I'm not seeing here. I'm seeing a bunch of storage containers. I mean, well, actually, oh, how do I get up there? Hold on. I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. How do I get up here? Can I jump up on this? Oh, here we go. Perfect. All right. Figured it out. I don't know if that was necessarily the way I was supposed to get up here, but it worked. All right. Let's take a look inside. What? Trapdoor is Oh, the frickin' thing's off. Okay, fine. Generator, where are you? Up, up. Where does it run to? We got the box. I don't need to worry about that. Where do you go all the way to? Hmm. What we got down here? Aha! There we go. Okay, that had to have done it. And also, is there anything down underneath this? It doesn't look like it. Alright. Back up into the train car we go. And I am definitely going to quick save before I do that to avoid any sorts of crashes. And in we go. Alright, let's see. This isn't actually all that involved. Well then, and it doesn't actually look like there's hardly anything. There's a railway rifle, which I... I mean, I already, I mean, I guess I have a harpoon gun, but I already have a railway rifle. I don't need that. It's actually in my, it's a back at my house. Because, like, how much is that going to do in comparison? 127, or 188 versus, well, maybe, uh, maybe I should have it, honestly. I mean, okay, yeah, it doesn't, it, I mean, it fires sort of, hmm. 
Maybe I just need to straight up go back and get my old one. I think that's probably what I really need to do. I need to go back and add that to my arsenal. You know what? We'll, we'll do that when we get to, like, the glowing sea, because we're definitely going to need a little bit extra once we get to that point. We got a 10-meter pistol, and then... Oh, no! Oh, I get the implication now. Oh, no! Come on, Fallout! Come on! That... <sighs> Why you gotta be such a downer all the time? Oh, that was the key for the safe back up there. Well, son of a... Now I'm just sad. And don't forget the fact that they had to drive home the point that they were five and seven years old, respectively. Gosh dang it, Fallout. Gosh dang it. Why you gotta do this? Why you gotta be like this and make me sad? You're supposed to be dark but humorous, not just dark. I don't want to defend the checkpoint. Gosh dang it. All right, what do we got? What are we going to be fighting against? Well, this already looks good. What do we got? We got gunners. Oh, my gosh. All right, what do we... Here, let's just go over this way. Hello there. There is power armor. All of them appear to be lieutenants. All right, I hope that felt good. I, I definitely need to just switch to the rail ri railway rifle because this is... This thing is just not as good. It just isn't. Hold on. That's going to be a crit. Say goodbye to your head. Okay, well, it didn't quite come off. Ow. There's a gunner commander who's at level, a higher level than me. Seriously? Probably didn't feel too... Uh, oh, okay. That was just a very delayed reaction. Hold on. Right, I could probably be using the Uzinator on these guys. Hello? I'm coming. I'm coming. Just a second. Eh. Please die. Oh, gosh. Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Have that. Sorry, dog meat. That's probably not going to feel too good. There we go. Now we kill you. Goodbye, sir. Now you're dead. Who? Where is the last one? Where is the last one? There you are. I'm flanking. I'm flanking. Okay, don't hurt me with your grenades, guys. Ah, frick. Reload. Oh, gosh dang it. Get him, dog meat. Okay, we got it. Sweet. Holy crap. Right. Hey, wait, did I? Wait, hold on. Did I just level up there? Oh, I did. Oh, my gosh. I need to actually use that. Um, let's grab all of this stuff. Perfect. Plasma cartridges. I will happily take those. And let's start moving over this way. Okay, so it appears we have a church up ahead. Um, I'm going to go for that first, and then we'll worry about the little settlements slash towns over that way. Where are we exactly at on the map in relation to these things? Okay. Oh, so there's Jamaica Plain. Which we got that flyer for um, a ways back. Oh, this is a high school. Shaw High School. Oh, interesting. Well, we should probably take a look inside then, shouldn't we? All right, well, I am going to switch back to the pistol. Unless there's robots in here, in which case I'll be switching to energy. And uh, quick save, and let's head on inside. This already looks fun. Oh, no. Not more super mutants. Actually, maybe I can get away with using energy against these guys. All right. Well, here we go. Gosh, dang it. Freaking more super mutants. Seriously. All right. Well, I'm going to move in here real quick. Expert level. Let's see. We got a novice terminal here. Let's try that. Uh, huts, maybe? Okay. Nope. So then that would mean it is probably sits. through. Memo to faculty and staff. Memo from Principal Tanner. For the desk of Principal Ronald Tanner, memo to faculty and staff. Hello. As you all probably know, our school has seen quite the jump in average standardized test scores as of late. And congratulations are obviously in order. Since leadership starts at the top and I will be accepting administrator, Administrative Officer of the Year Award at the next month's school district meeting. They have asked I keep my speech short, so I have obviously kept my thanks to those closest to the project in order to focus more time on my thoughts and plans for the coming years. Good typo. Know that each uh, each of you has done your part, and I thank you for even the smallest contribution because of these events. You may hear rumors of budget increases to our school. While some of these rumors may be true, the increase will probably be minimal, and I will be uh, and will be allocated to equipment and facility upgrades. However, I may I have earmarked a portion of the budget for a faculty staff mixer this next weekend. From the hours of six to six forty five as a token of my a token of my appreciation. Good work and go Cougars. There's another memo. 
Hello, many of you expressed concern over the delay in equipment upgrades promised recently. Let me assure all of you that I have called the district office and top men are looking into the shipping error. Until then, please continue work as normal with the equipment we have available. The same equipment, I'll remind some of you, that has helped to increase our test scores in order to receive the budget increase. If it's not broke, don't fix it. As I always say, go Cougars. Read only. Hello, all teachers and staff are hereby given the rest of the week off and should let their students go as well. When you receive this, please cancel all your plans, excuse your class, and leave in a quiet or orderly manner. I'll be very busy in my office adjusting my hairpiece, so under no circumstances am I to be notified or bothered. In addition, all students in Mr. Wellborn's history class will be graded on a scale of an A to an A minus instead of the usual A to F. This change is in or, or accordance uh, to recent studies from the district office. Uh, you all know how much I love the district office. Office. I'm an idiot, Principal Butt Toots. I get the feeling that that wasn't actually him. And also, P.S. Rusty Burton for Homecoming King. Hello, it goes without saying that I am extremely disappointed in the gullibility of the faculty during last week's events. I find it hard to believe that almost all of you did not realize that the memo was an obvious forgery. Those of you off for most of the last week will unfortunately be dock pay for the days you missed. Perhaps this will remind you to be available by phone in off hours. Also, please take a moment to change your password on your terminals, as I have been told that the default one has been made the rounds amongst the students. In addition, locks are being added to most doors to increase safety measure. Finally, Mr. Wellborn, Rusty Burton will be absent from your class for the next few weeks. Please have his homework available for him to pick up at the end of each day. Principal Tanner. A story and four different entries. Okay. Let's see if we can get through this door. Hmm. Oh, almost. That was definitely a worn out bobby pin from when I was opening that master lock earlier. Let's try to get it. Oh, oh, almost. Did you go the wrong way? I did go the wrong way. That. How about with how about right there? Perfect. Yes. Sweet. All right, we got another room. What is this one? Principal Tanner's terminal. Oh, gosh, are we already getting into this? Personal folder, letter from Super... You know, I get the feeling that maybe I shouldn't read this one yet. Hold on. We'll come back here. I'm going to come back, because I'm sure... I get the feeling I shouldn't go through that just yet. All right, let's see. We got this guy over here. No. Yes. Okay, this is not doing a whole lot of damage. There we go. Hit the glowing mutant hound. There we go. Oh, I did not get him that time. Woo! We're good. Okay, you're dead. You're dead. Woo! You're dead. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Let's switch back over to... No, you know what? Let's let's stay on it. I, I need to get rid of my freaking broadsider, though, because that thing sucks. Okay, and this thing sucks, too. Uh, yay, yay. I am so annoyed with these freaking super mutants already in this episode. Please land your freaking shots. Uh, I'm so glad you're not a legendary. Okay, hold on. Give me my AP. And my crits. Thank you. I'm pretty sure I didn't make you, dude. I'm pretty sure that was the Institute's doing. I also blew up the Institute, so you should be grateful. Also, we got Tato's in here. Okay. Ooh, and pan bones. Sweet. A good source of fiber. But not the foot bones, though. Those aren't as those aren't as good for you. Um, <laughs> I actually th actually I should have said calcium, not fiber, because it's it's bone. But well, whatever. I I sort of I sort of had that joke down until I didn't. Just ignore me, okay? Well, don't ignore me. I need you to watch this episode. So ignore my joke. That was not very funny. Gosh, dang it! The AC came on. You're gonna probably hear that in the background a lot, by the way. I apologize. Um, just because. I need to keep this uh, this recording area clean while I do these, or clean, excuse me, cold while I do these episodes. Um, otherwise, my computer will just straight up die on me. My basically almost already dead computer as it is. All right, sir, I am just going to empty that entire clip into you until you die. Did a good job. All right, let's keep moving. Got more. That's another overlord. Okay, you are going to get crit in the face. And then we are just going to kill you that way. Perfect. It actually seems like there's a whole lot of super mutants in here, which is good. Although I will say in this one particular instance, I kind of do wish I had like a shotgun of some sort. Wait, I actually, I already went this way, didn't I? No, I didn't. Did I? Did, mm, 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 I did not. Okay, we got an open door here. Oh, a science classroom. Okay, we'll be going out through all this in a sec. I just got to find, oh, there's like a lower level. Hold on. Open that. That's a bathroom. Is there anything of note in any of these? Is that an overdue book? Yes. Okay, I will take that then. 
And I will also take that. Actually, I don't know why I keep taking stem packs. I don't need more stem packs. I have so many stem packs. It's absolutely absurd. And that Tesla arc went off, which is good. So now I can just leave and come back later. There's another door here. All right, where does this, this is, this is nothing. There is nothing in here of, that is of any use to me. And this is basically just an empty room. Well, okay then. Gosh, well, where is this last freaking super mutant, man? I wanna find, oh, we got a, oh, we got a master level door. Um, I probably shouldn't try to go through that just yet. That's probably where the last super mutant is, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, I hear you. Oh, I hear more. Okay. Um, that one is probably the one that's through the door. Well, where the freak is this other guy? He probably fell through the floor or something. No, I don't, I don't know. All right, well, I'm not good getting anywhere just wandering around this place. I should probably, oh, wait, hold on, what do we got here? Ah, here we go. Perfect. It's a, a puppy. Hi. Okay, get out of here. Let's see. Anything in these meat bags? Actually, yes, there are plenty of things in these meat bags, and I will take all of them. 556 rounds, 50 cals. Wait, wait, hold on. I saw bottle caps. Eh. Give me the bottle. Oh, almost had it. It's a little meat bag. I think. What are you blowing up over there? That's that's none of that's my doing. That is all on you, sir. We got one more here with the plasma cartridge, and these are. This is rad stag meat and mongrel dog meat. Okay, so this is clearly where they were just storing all their food, I guess. Well, we'll head over that way in a second. Let's go into the science room next, which actually I think was over this way. It was on this floor. I don't want to go upstairs. So let's go into the science room first, and let's take a look at this terminal. And oh, oh, maybe this is... Well, maybe this one is different. Lance. Aside. Um, flame? Proof. Got it. There we go. Okay, now that's the, that's the same as the other faculty terminal. Okay, so there was nothing of value there. That's just a regular folder. Alrighty then. Don't need to go here. Let's head upstairs. Hmm. Oh, hold on. Locker with the bottle caps, and that's it. And then... Okay, oh, hello. Oh, hold on, hold on. I do want that, Psycho and Jet. Some kid had drugs in there. And glue! Oh, you don't want to be huffing glue. That's probably not a good idea. We got a... I did not want the burnt Grognak comic. I wanted the overdue book. We got a Vault Tech lunchbox with a tablespoon that I will not be taking. And then, ooh, we got a terminal here. A terminal and principal's office key. Okay, we are definitely going to go to the principal's office next. Rusty's journal. Keep out. Another high software detected. The following programs are no longer functioning. All right, let's do this thing. This is Rusty Burton, and all you jerkwads trying to read my thoughts better step off. I find anybody reading this, and you're in for an atomic wedgie you'll never forget. You have been warned. Ha, I'm in. This terminal is mine. Can't believe that nerd Clayton fixed up this computer so it doesn't erase everything after class. Little geek done good. But I'm still taking his lunch money today. Maybe I won't pound him so hard, but I gotta eat something. Anyway, this class is boring, but Mr. Ramirez flips out if it doesn't make uh, look like I'm typing. That therapist my mom makes me go to says I should write out my feelings more anyway. So how, what the hell? Let's see if this works. Rusty rules. Principal Tanner pulled me out of class today, and I was pissed, because, like, I didn't even do anything. Turns out he wants me to do some work for him. Told me to start selling Mentats around school. I said, what's in it for me, Tanner? Longer lunchtime and some stuff taken off my permanent record. How's that for a deal, huh? And, I mean, I sell stuff already, so no sweat. I just hang out, hand out these Mentats instead, and it's free ride the rest of the year. Even tried a few of them. Man, they make my head feel funny, but it feels like everything Mr. Ramirez is saying makes sense now, right? Weird. Tanner has kept up his part of our agreement, keeping my lunch hours long as long as I distribute men Mentats amongst the other students. Funny, he doesn't seem to notice that I've also been taking them. My parents have. I came home with a B-plus test grade and one that I'd earned myself. I didn't even have to copy off of Clayton. Tanner seems pleased, though. I haven't quite put together why he would throw his hat in with me and other school miscreants for his goal, but I feel like I'm getting closer to figuring it out every day. Rusty Burton signing off. I think I've deduced Principal Planner's plot. After... Announcing a rise in test scores, it all became clear to me. Tanner hopes to earn himself accommodations from Superintendent Marcello and the school board by raising standardized test scores. An ingenious plan, one the old Rusty wouldn't have pieced together. But how to turn this to my advantage? <laughs> 
As I predicted, Tanner leaves his office door unlocked when using the restroom. I was able to sneak in and make a pressing of the key and Clay a requisition from the art department. Yesterday, using my new key, I entered his office, used his terminal, and found a stash of Mentats. I also read his logs and verified my theory. He is using raised test scores to increase school funds and pocketing most of it. Now I have what I need. I've arranged a meeting in the library study with room with Tanner. I'm doing most of the hard work. Why shouldn't I benefit from the cash flow increase? Finally, I'll be able to buy that telescope I've been wanting. So he turned into a nerd! Freaking nerd! Oh my gosh, you're such a nerd, Rusty. Can't believe you. I'll take those electromagnetic cartridges that are for some reason in the teacher's desk. Alright, let's go over to the principal's office now. Take a look at that before we go through the big door. Um, apparently that is not the one. Wait, hold on. Uh, uh, hold on. Where? It's the desk. There we go. Library key. Oh! Library key. Okay, that's probably the other door then. Well then. Okay, so that was probably what got me through the first door. Got it. Now let's head on upstairs. Let's get our gun ready too because we know we're going to be dealing with a lot of enemies here soon. Let's see. Oh, nope. This is not the right way. Where is it? Is it over here? No, 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 no. This way? There we go. Library key. Perfect. Hello? We got it. Oh, so that was a turret. Let's take that out first. Then that. Alright, where is the other super mutant? I know there was a warlord in here. There it is. Hello. What's up, dude? I'm just gonna pop you in the head really quickly. Okay, that's some good damage. Alright, now we move, now we move, now we move. And we just gotta pump all of our shots into you, sir. There we go. Holy crap, that is so much ammo. Jeez. We got that, we got an armor workbench, we got all this cool stuff. Unstoppables, we got some Mentats and an overdue book. A few overdue books, never mind. Um, is there possibly a key to the... You know what, here, let's take a look at the, this thing, and maybe it's in there. Book return machine. Let's return all of our overdue books. Okay, we got a bunch of those, spend tokens. What do we got? Mentats, Mentats, okay, just Mentats. I would not be able to afford all that. Scissors, teddy bear, and a toothbrush. Yeah, it's a lot of tokens for those Mentats, so let's unlock this door. What do we got here? Hello? Uh oh, property of R. Burton. All right, Burton. I'm here. Hurry up. Out with it. I have a lot of plans for this summer, and none of them involve chatting with you. Why, Ronald, I'm hurt. Skipping the pleasantries and getting right down to business. And after all we've accomplished together this semester. For the last time, you little snot, it's Principal Tanner. Fine, Principal Tanner. I'll make this quick. You've been giving me Mentas to distribute to the students quietly and under the nose of the faculty. I have. Because of this, test scores have skyrocketed. The school board has noticed. We received quite an increase in funding. But the faculty doesn't know. No one here knows except you. And now, me. You've been skimming off the top and pocketing most of the funds. I want 50% of what you're embezzling. We'll go to Superintendent Marcella with this. What? How did you... When did you get so smart? You've been giving me brain pills every week. What did you expect, you pathetic little man? <laughs> well... <laughs> so what if it's all true? No one's going to believe you. You're just a kid, and I'm the principal, and more importantly, an adult. Oh, I think they'll believe me, Ronald. Especially after they hear you admit everything in your own words. What are you talking about? Wait, is that a hollow tape? You son of a... Uh-oh. Well, I hope he didn't, like, try to, like, kill Rusty or anything, because that would suck. But uh, let's try to get in through this door now. It's a master level lock, so I don't really know where the key is supposed to be for this, if there even is one. So I'm going to guess right about there. Yep. You got it. All right, what do we got? Oh, jeez, that's a lot of Mentats. Holy, and a n combat knife. All right, that's a little concerning. Tons of Mentats, though. Wow. Well, I guess if you ever need those, freaking come to Shaw High School. This is the place to be. All right, sweet. Well, let's get on out of here now that we're done with this place. And again, make sure to quick save before going through a door. 
Now, see, those are the kinds of locations where when you go through them and you actually learn, you know, that you get that kind of a story. Those are the locations that make all of this exploring worth it, in my opinion. I freaking love that stuff. That is, those are like the highlight moments of Fallout to me. Also, you've got to be kidding me. Okay. We got ourselves another freaking set of Brotherhood, guys. Let's take out this stupid Vertibird. Go down. There you go. All right, you're dead. Oof. Probably didn't feel too good at all. We got a couple dead ones. We got some tank bots. All right, that's a little concerning. Um, can we hit... Hold on, where is it? Eh. No, uh, uh, do you not have a thing? Okay, I guess you don't have the thing that I thought that you had. Take it out. Okay, there we go. There goes that. That's going to explode. We got a Brotherhood Knight over here with his power armor. Eh. Got rid of you. And I think that does it. Awesome. All right, I will definitely take your flare... I will definitely take your ammo and your ammo and we will just leave the rest and continue on over toward, what was it, Jamaica Plain, I think? I think it was Jamaica Plain. Um, never mind, not going to worry about gas prices right now. Holy cow. All right. On over this way, and actually, looking at our time, we're probably going to have to call this quits. I know I'm saying this at the end of the episode, but I just wanted to apologize. Um... End of the episode, excuse me. I wanted to apologize for this video being so freaking late just because, well, y'all know what's going on in the world right now. I don't really need to t talk about it in too much detail, um, but, okay, this is this is going to get weird. This is going to get weird. Um, I don't need to talk about it in too much detail, but y'all know what's going on. Um, the funny thing is, is that I um, actually work in an essential capacity, so I have been, even in the middle of all of this, still been working. And that has definitely gotten in the way of trying to do video content just because things have gotten really weird as a result. And, you know, life, life's just been hectic for everybody and, you know, me included because I haven't actually been able to be quarantined like everyone else. Um, not out of, not for lack of trying, mind you. It's more the fact that I don't really have a choice in the matter. Um, so... Yeah, I've been kind of stuck here. Oh, gosh, freaking mind. I've been kind of, you know, stuck working for most of this entire situation, and it's just made it really hard to get around to recording videos. So it, it's it's caused a few problems, but for the most part, um, things should be back in normal order, uh, starting with this video. And, of course, you know, other Let's Plays, they're... They're, they're getting there. They're, they're getting there. Ooh, there's a workshop here as well. Um, so, yeah, don't worry about it too much, but sorry for missing the video last week and then also putting this one up late as a result. So, thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode very, very much, and I will see you all in the next one.